Okay. As you can see, I have modified my machine some. What I have here are 3 inch by 3 inch um, T slots. Here's one right here. 3 inch squares. <clears throat> I've raised it up so that I can swing more material. And I still have my center right here. I have an inch play right there. Up. I can come up above my uh, center, which I'm really not going to be doing anyway, because if I do any plowing, I'm going to punch through the middle of it. And as you can see, I can reach the middle here fairly easy. I'll be using a two inch, I mean, a, my half inch bit that's two inches long, so I've got, I can get in there with that, no problem. This is what I had prior. Okay. You see that? That's not much clearance. And this is a six inch circle that I cut out right here. So what I've done is I've made it to where, let's see if I can slip it right over it now. Now, I got plenty of clearance. So I can actually swing eight inch, nine inch material easily. Now it'll swing across the bed. And I've got it where I can take it to keep from hitting <clears throat> my gantry right here. I've got it where I can slide this way and this way. You see, I can come on out here and then bring it down to whatever size I want to bring it to and work from here in to the center. Which, you know, this one slides too. I've just got it a little snug. As you can see, it slides. Oh, it doesn't push it because it pulls. But, that's the idea. <clears throat> Pretty cool, huh? And we will test it out. I went and looked at some material, so I'll be testing this little baby out pretty soon. Yeah, cool, huh?